You too. We doing plant based burritos today. All right, let's go. Got the uh, plant based ground beef. We're gonna go ahead and get in the skillet, season the shit out of it. All right. We're gonna go ahead and get that pan nice and hot, baby. Just throw that motherfucker on number six. All right. Spray it with some oil. Then drop that meat in there. Once you drop it in there, it's gonna start cooking. Just go ahead and just start breaking it up with a spatula for it. Now, once we get this shit out the way, let's add some taco sauce. Well, not the taco, or well, the taco seasoning. It's the taco skillet sauce. Let me show y'all right quick. This shit right here. Alright. Now, after you pour this little taco sauce in there, the skillet sauce, this is set your flavor off right there. You don't need shit else, alright? No more seasoning. Just add this shit right here, and you good. Get that shit stirred up, and let it cook. Beyond meat, it don't take that long. It takes them five to seven minutes. Really, it don't take that long. You know what I'm saying? That's why I added the sauce. You add that shit immediately when you're cooking with Beyond Meat. Beyond Meat, and plus, it's quicker and it's more healthier, too. This shit good for you. You know what I mean? Plant-based, you feel a lot better once you eat this instead of eating that bullshit. The older you get, I mean, take care of your damn self. You know what I'm talking about? Because, you know, you know, fucking with this, you get more bang for your buck. You know how expensive this shit is. You know what I'm saying? Like, meat and all this shit right now. Because of this virus and pandemic and shit. Hey, get you some plant based. You might as well go ahead and get in shape and get healthy while this shit going on. Instead of sitting on your ass. Alright. Now, since this shit almost, it is, it's basically done. Because it's been like damn that seven, about five to six minutes. So plant based don't take that long. You see that? It don't take that long. See how it's starting to burn? Just go ahead and cut it off. Only reason I do it like that because I'm pretty fucking good at it. Just cut it off. You know what I'm saying? Just go ahead and take it off to the side. And just what I do, sit it in the middle, all right? Now I'm finna go in here and prepare the tortillas. Got some onion, you know, to go with it, but I, I forgot the shit, I forgot the fucking onion and left it at the stove. So, you know, I ain't no onion this time, you know what I'm saying? But, hey, like I say, put the fuck you want to put in it. But when I finish, it's gonna be fine, all right? Let's go. Hey, just lay your piece of foil down, right? Lay that foil down, we finna grab the tortillas. And see, y'all know I fuck with these right here. And the reason I fuck with these right here because they, they're a little flimsy, but they stronger than the other. You know how the other little cheap-ass burritos, they tear. As soon as you try to fold them and try to wrap them up or whatever, as soon as you try to roll the sun, bitches, they tear up or a hole poking out and all kind of shit. They, they, give you, they give you a hard time. These really don't give you a hard time. I mean, they're going to do the job. And plus, they taste better. They're more thinner, but they're more stronger too, all right? C plus these are smaller, so you can make small burritos or you can make tacos out of them. But they're real flimsy, so I suggest that you, you know, make a burrito out of them. But, you know, you can make a taco if you want to. You know what I'm saying? Be my motherfucking guest. But shit, I'm going to go ahead and make burritos out this here. Now let's add some cheese. Go and throw this in the microwave for 90 seconds. Get that shit out the way. We're going to go ahead and put this in the microwave. This ain't no lasagna today, baby. And then what? Cut the microwave on. Yay! <laughs> Moving the fuck on. Got the organic simple truth. Mexican blend cheese, baby. You got the cheese. You're going to get you some Fiesta coin. And you can get it at any local store near you. You're going to get your Beyond Meat. You're going to add your little bit more cheese. Like I say, we ain't doing it to hold hands. We're doing it to lock fingers. Just add a little cheese. You want to lock fingers? Not hold hands. You remember what I said in that lasagna video? You got damn right. It sticks right here, too. And then you add your rice. And when you add your rice, you add just a little more sprinkle of cheese and roll on up. Cheese. Let's roll it. Easy money, baby. Roll it, set it to the side, and repeat. Now, for a lot of some of you motherfuckers out there, I know y'all gonna make this goddamn mistake. Y'all gonna put too much in here, and it's gonna bust open. You know how I know you gonna make that mistake? Because I just made that goddamn mistake. And when y'all make that goddamn mistake, hey, double wrap it. Then right there is double wrap. These right here, they ain't double wrap. I bust it open. So you double wrap it. See, when you double wrap it, all you gotta do for that layer, that second layer, just put some cheese on the outside wall and then put the burrito in there and double wrap it so it can be more cheesier so you ain't got to just have two layers of a damn tortilla. All right? And roll it up. All my ducks in a row. All right? Get that pan nice and hot. Put a little oil in the bottom if you want to. I prefer it because if you don't, your shit gonna stick. See? Folded side. You see that seam? The folded side down. So you're going to get that to stick. It's going to stick together, all right? Fold the side down. And let it cook just like that. 
See what you're doing, you ain't doing nothing like you know how, like a grill stuff burrito and shit. You can use a little, you know, you can use any kind of thing, a grill or whatever. But I, I'm choosing this pan right here because hey, that's the first thing I grab. We're gonna go ahead and just let them cook just like that, and you can turn them over with your hand if you ain't scared, alright? Just let them cook for like a minute or something. You can let it cook for like a minute or two. You know what I'm saying? You're going to hear it sizzling a little bit. Hey, don't worry about it. Let it sizzle a little bit. You know what I'm talking about? And then flip it over with your hand. Flip them over and do the other side. See what I'm saying? That's all you're doing. Now, you want the cheese and all that shit to melt on the inside? Go and put that top on. Lay it on. Let it get it on for about five or ten minutes. Now let's go ahead and get them up out of there and split one open. That's what you got. Now that's 100. Alright? Won't break off up. That's what you got right there, baby. Alright? Thank you for watching. Beyond me and it's fire. Alright? Y'all be cool. Holler back at me and I'll be seen. Oh, y'all seen that light in the background. I know y'all laughing. Oh, he over there eat healthy. Why he smoking cigarettes? Nah, that's not a cigarette lighter. That's, they're like candles, motherfucker. Get it right. You know what I mean? Hey, take care of yourself. Sometimes, yes, I do eat plant-based shit. Sometimes I go without, you know, eating meat. Yeah, because you got to take care of yourself sometimes. Sometimes you got to eat shit out of moderation. I like chili cheese, dog chicken, and all that bullshit too. But I eat it out of motherfucking ration. Moderation. You know, don't eat the shit every day. Don't destroy your body. The older you get, the more you take care of yourself. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to start that shit when you're younger. But still, though, just take care of yourself. You live long. You feel better. You know what I'm saying? You fuck good, all that. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm gone, baby. I'll be seeing you.